Aloha. I'm Shuji Komagata, a chaplain in the Honolulu Police Department. I would like to begin this tribute to our fallen officers with a scripture reading and prayer. Our heroes are gone now from us all, but where did they go? They followed the destiny of dues in the field. How dear are the memories of those who once lived. When responding to the call of the people's needs, there's nothing to think over or reflect upon. With deep sincerity in heart, straightforwardly, they gave their lives for our sake. Noble are they. Though the date of their death comes and goes many times, the great deed of their valor will never die out. Whenever our eyes should cloud with tears of sorrow, we call to mind all the more words of Buddha's truth. Colors are added to the brilliance of the shrine. Flowers are beautiful, wafting sweet fragrance. With hopes of prosperity for the people's future, the light shines radiantly, leaving no dark space. As we remember the 50 officers of the Honolulu Police Department who died in the line of duty, whether as a result of criminal violence or hazardous circumstances, let us also remember their lives, knowing that they served the city and county of Honolulu to the highest standard, standing in harm's way for us. We pray for these officers' continued repose and pray for the continued healing of their families. Namu kie butsu, namu kie ho, namu kie so. Grateful for their service, let us now pay tribute to them. Aloha. Every day, the brave men and women of law enforcement answer their call to serve and protect their community. They endure long shifts in dangerous and unpredictable circumstances, all the while displaying the courage and honor that policing requires and that the public has come to expect. During National Police Week, we recognize the fearless and dedicated protectors who wear the badge and willingly risk their lives to protect others. We especially honor the memory and legacy of the officers whose lives were tragically taken in the line of duty. They will forever be remembered as heroes. To the families whose loved ones did not come home at the end of their shift, we offer our heartfelt gratitude for your ongoing sacrifice. We will not forget you and you will always be part of the HPD Ohana. Let us also honor the valor of those officers we have lost by supporting those who remain and continue to serve each and every day. Their hard work and dedication not only serve as an inspiration to us all, but as an ongoing tribute to those who have made the ultimate sacrifice. They carry on and work tirelessly to ensure that the people they serve can continue to live in peace and security. May we always provide these dedicated professionals with the support and appreciation they deserve as they continue to hold the line for those we've lost. Constable Kaolana. Detective James Kaohane. Officer John W. Wolbers. Officer John W. Mahilona. Officer Manuel D. Abu. Officer Frederick Wright.
Officer James K. Keonauna. Officer David W. Mahukona. Officer Edwin H. Boyd. Officer George Macy. Officer Samson Paele. Detective William K. Kama. Officer George Rogers. Officer David K. Kaohi. Sergeant Henry A. Chillingworth. Officer Wa Chun Lee. Officer Alfred W. Dennis. Officer Joseph K. Woodford, Jr. Officer Abraham E. Mahiko. Officer Andrew R. Morales. Officer Patrick K. Ihu. Lieutenant Benedict Elenecki. Officer Bradley N. Kaanana. Officer Frank R. Maderos. Reserve Officer Ernest G. Lindemann. Officer David R. Huber. Officer Benjamin Kealoha, Jr. Officer Robert A. Corder. Officer Larry J. Stewart. Pilot Thomas A. Moher. Officer Merlin Kael. Officer Ernest R. Grog. Officer David W. Parker. Officer David N. Ronk. Officer Troy L. 
Bob Walser. Officer Roy E. Thurman. Officer Randall N. Young. Officer Bryant B. Bain. Officer Tate D. Kahakai. Officer Danny Griggs M. Parial. Officer Glenn A. Gaspar. Officer Ryan K. Goto. Officer Isaac Veal. Officer Steve B. Favela. Sergeant Harry J. Coelho. Officer Eric C. Fontes. Officer Garrett C. Davis. Officer Chad M. Morimoto. Officer Tiffany Victoria B. Enriquez. Officer Kaulike S. G. Kalamo. 